Hey guys. Um I was think I was looking at this BBC documentary um of Nature Boy. I'll have the link in the description. I didn't even know that they would even do a documentary on his ass. I didn't know he was all like that. Um this it was from 4 years ago. But I was uh thinking about Pharaoh. Pharaoh, I, I just wanted to say that uh, you know, you saying you want to live a poly lifestyle. Poly is just not for you, dude. It's just not. It comes a point in time where you need to realize that. You know, you just do. You know, I, I just can't see it. You, He say that the house that he got was for that, I guess, for four or five wives, his family. But for a nigga to want to be poly and have all those wives and don't even have one person. He ain't even got one bitch. The nigga is like, ain't got nobody at all. Like, how do you go from wanting that and living, wanting to live that type of lifestyle to you ain't even got one bitch? I mean, that's there still riding with you who got your back. I mean, Nature Boy even managed to have a. Uh, you know, probably still two if all of them left. It'll be two of the women, maybe one man that is still going to stick by his side no matter what. Jamil, he going to always have him one or two. So with your ass, you know, y'all all kind of like in the same category when it comes to this black community conscious shit. Like you the only one who just stand out like this. It's not for you. Like I just can't see him go from being single with nobody at all right now to having four or five wives. It's just not about to happen. Like some people have that naturally about them where people, you know, gravitate towards them, still listen to them, respect them, treat them, submit to them, you know. And then there's those type of guys where like young Pharaoh, where I, I just don't see a woman submitting to him at all. I cannot see. It's just not about to happen. I don't see no woman taking him serious, no woman fucking sitting there submitting to him. I do not see four people, you know, four wives treating him like a king, one rubbing his feet, one rubbing his hands, one um, giving him some cold water all at the same time. Hell, motherfucker, I didn't know. No one is going to do that at all. No, I don't see no women whatsoever. He can say, oh, you know, the white woman, because black women don't want to submit not even a white woman is going to treat you like a king or submit to you at all, ever, ever in life. The only way you will have that or pull that off is if you talk to some women who slow or you got some money and not the delusional money you think you got, nigga. And in order to have a white woman, you know, for sure, for sure, nigga, you got to be somewhere in life to where she even want to pay attention to your ass to even give you a motherfucking chance. You got to have something with a white woman, okay? Now, a black woman, what they, what our dumb asses, we will still talk to him while he be putting us down and shit. But a white woman, you have to be, you have to be, you know, in a certain point in your life to where she sees something, you know what I'm saying? And it got to be on a consistent basis for her to make the decision to want to be by your motherfucking side. Because other than that, I just don't see it. So, you know, you might as well just give it up. Give it up. Now, it'd be different if he the type of guy who wants to get married, have kids, and then all of a sudden we see that him and his, you know, Golden broke up and we're not. But for this nigga to say he bought the house to be poly, he want to be poly four or five wives, and this nigga ain't even got one bitch? Like, come on now, dude. It's it went, Enough is enough, okay? Just go on and be one woman's man. The poly, you can't force a motherfucker to treat you like a king. You can't force a motherfucker to sit there and submit to you. Like, <laughs> if that's not what they want to do naturally, nigga, then it's just not about to work, dude. You know, you 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 gonna be stagnant, you know, in your life if you just really think that you're gonna have that type of lifestyle. It's just not gonna happen. You're never gonna grow. You might as well just go on and give it up is not. Ain't nobody about to submit to you. No woman will even take you serious, listen to you, value your opinion. Nothing. Nothing. That's not. Now, he could have pulled that off when he was with that girl, Yogini, 
And he said he always want to blame Golden and say she was the one who fucked it up. Well, no, Golden not the one who fucked it up because he could have told Golden, fuck her. Golden, everybody know, not the type that was in the black conscious community, you know, like Yogini, all deep into the shit like that. She wasn't, you know, maybe she was willing to get into it because she was with him and learn about it and turn into it or whatnot. But Yogini, you should have stuck with her. You know, and then if you were to stay with Yogini, I think that you could have pulled that off. Um, you know what I'm saying? Because Yogini probably would have been for it, you know, and then you still would be doing your lectures. You will still be on it as far as everything that you was doing before. Other than that, nah, you should have got rid of her. You should have got rid of Golden and stay with Yogini. Then you could have pulled it off. But other than that, you just... You just not going to be able to pull that off, dude, at all. You you need to realize that, that no woman is going to submit to you at all. You just not that type of guy where a woman is about to be um, <clears throat> listening to you like that. They, they Unless you got money, you know, and, and, and we know you ain't got no money now because if you had some money, nigga, you would have women. Oh, yeah, you would. You will have a woman. You will have probably two or three different little bitches. Yeah. Yeah, no, you ain't got shit right now. Yep. That's the only or or here go another option. You can go and get nature boy girls. Shit, that'd be super easy. Cause he done already brainwashed they asses. Yeah, just go on and just get they ass. They think he getting out of jail. The nigga don't seem like he gonna be getting out. So you might as well just start inboxing they ass, telling them to come on right oh, you got the house for him already. If they get kicked out of that house, that nature boy got they could come right to you. Take over his shit. Yeah, that's the only way I see that working. Yep. I, only way, either that, you got some money, some real motherfucking money, okay, or you find some women that's slow, because other than that, or drug addicts, because I can't see nobody submitting to this nigga. Y'all know I'm not lying. I just can't. No woman's about to be respecting him like that. Now, if he w- he is a one woman's man, yeah, I can see him in a relationship with a woman and her falling in love with him. And, you know, they, they you know, doing their thing, growing in life, you know, showing us their little vlogs and families and, you know, doing shit like that. Other than that, he, he might as well just go on and give up the poly lifestyle because... That's just not about to work, you know, at all. It could work for Jamil. It could work for Nature Boy. It's just not about to work for you, dude, at all. All right? I'm sorry to break the bad news to you, but, yeah, you if you hear this, just start thinking about that. You're just not about to about to have women like that. Now, again, you have, a, you, you have a good chance at it if you go over there and steal Nature Boy girls, okay? Because they don't need somewhere to go. Other than that, it's a wrap. Might as well give it up, nigga. Throw the towel in. Because it's just not... No woman is about to submit to you. Not even a white woman, nigga. I can't even see a motherfucking dog submit to your stupid ass. Okay? Yeah. Just go on and get that shit up. I thought I'd let you know that. And thank me later, motherfucker.